Grace Mullane died while backpacking in New Zealand. The 22-year-old was last seen after a night out with a man she'd met on a dating website. In police interview, the man, whose identity can't be revealed for legal reasons, said they'd parted company on December the 1st last year. I tried to text her the next day yeah. um, on Tinder, but yeah. I'd been unmatched. OK. And I was like, oh, what's going on here? I must have done the wrong thing. The man told police after saying goodbye to Grace, he carried on drinking and couldn't remember anything until he woke up around 9 or 10 o'clock the next morning. Detectives later showed him CCTV of him wheeling a suitcase into a hotel lift at 8.15 a.m., around an hour before the man said he'd woken up. I might have got the times wrong, but if you're assuming that I was using that suitcase for something, I've still got that suitcase in my room. The defendant doesn't deny Grace died in his room in this hotel, but argues he didn't mean to kill her. Today, the court was played CCTV footage of him buying a suitcase around 8am on December the 2nd, Grace Mullane's birthday and the day after she disappeared. Security footage also showed him buying cleaning products from the supermarket and hiring a rental car. Prosecutors say the man strangled Grace Mullane before disposing of her body. He denies murder. Leila Hayes, 5 News.